thanks for tuning in. I appreciate you. Let's get right into it. Be advised. Hostile care package overhead. Oh, don't lay down. It ain't worth it. Yo, if you're not spawn trapping and you're in safeguard and you're playing safeguard, yo, I don't know what you're doing. Oh. Stick your head out. There you go. As far as advanced warfare is concerned, do you guys think it's dead? I mean, is it for real? Is it is it really dead? There we go. Colonel Sandal or Sand is I, I didn't I didn't really I can't I can't read. I don't know, personally, man, I I don't think it's dead. I don't think it was ever dead, to be honest, but um, it's just a lot of, ooh, it's just a lot of, um, it's just a lot of problems it's been having lately uh, with people playing it, man. People just don't want to play it anymore. I jumped into a lobby the other day when I was doing a Throwback Thursday video. I was sitting in a lobby for like, I don't know, maybe 20 minutes. It, it was crazy. I went in a Ghost, Call of Duty Ghost, and I was immediately put into a game. Uh, I'm not saying that I'm gonna be playing Call of Duty Ghost, my new Throwback Thursday video, but it, it, it might be Call of Duty Ghost. Ooh, two piece. Let's go. Um, but this is a shame, man. You know, a lot of people were hating on Advanced Warfare because they said it was too futuristic, it was too unrealistic, but I'm like, the boost dodging ability, the fact that it was competitive gameplay was, was I think, was the reason why. Oh, let me get these guys. Oh, yes, let's go. Let's go. Uh, was primarily the reason that I believe that people really strayed away from the game and got away from it a little bit, man. But you know, at the end of the day, hold on. I'm trying to focus and talk at the same time. That guy, there's a guy behind me. Oh, oh, what? Oh, good job, team. Let's go, team. Let's go. Uh, but I don't really think it's dead. I think the fact that people aren't playing it right now makes it dead. Um, the game, I really liked it. I, I thought it was a good game. I thought it needed some some help, though. I mean, but Sledgehammer making this game um, really, I mean, it really broke the mold a little bit for this futuristic type of gameplay. And I think, and I think, I don't know, I think it really helped out with uh, Black Ops 3 as well. Um, Black Ops 3 is a little slower, obviously, because you're not traversing around the map a lot quicker. But I do believe that it wasn't a, uh, it, it, it did have a, some type of effect on on the gameplay style that Black Ops 3 is right now, and that's why it's such a great game. Um, Treyarch is doing an amazing job with this game. They're listening to the community. Something that Sledgehammer wasn't doing as effectively. I don't know. Excuse me, I don't know what the problem... Oh, let me get this guy. There we go. I don't know what the problem was um, with Sledgehammer, but... Uh... uh oh, man. But, uh, you know, they, they just weren't listening to the community that well. Putting putting good players in a lobby full of bad players or vice versa, it wasn't really helping. You know, and it made a lot of... Ooh. Uh, where's that guy at? And it, made, it pissed a lot of people off. You know, people were dropping out of games a lot quicker. Um, but, I mean, you know, so do you guys think... Let me know down in the comment section below if you guys think that Advanced Warfare is dead. Um, obviously, obviously, oh, Colonel Sanders is his name. I killed that guy three times already. Um, obviously it wasn't a, it wasn't a, a game that, uh, that Black Ops 2 was. And I think people were looking for that, but you got to understand that when you're running into a new company, somebody that's doing something a little bit different, um, you gotta, you gotta, you gotta be able to adjust a little bit. People were like posting videos and them throwing away Black Ops, I mean, uh, throwing away Advanced Warfare. There's a guy coming to the left. There's a guy coming to the left. I don't I don't think they heard me. I wasn't loud enough. Ooh. Headshots. Colonel Sanders again. He just keeps running into my bullets, man. I don't know what it is. Ah. Nope, teammate. This is not gonna be a super high KD. But, uh, get out that window, boy. Let's keep going. Uh, 
I love I love the fact that you can swim in this game. I think it's dope. Our robot has been uh, that storm camo looks so sick. Look at it. Get out of our spawn, boy. Clean kill. After it's like every shot, after every shot I get shot. Uh, he's gonna show up right here. Yep. I believe you should jump into that spawn, man. Like I said before, if you're playing safeguard, you're not jumping into that spawn. I don't know what you're doing. I'm gonna pull up on him. That guy. That was Colonel Sanders again. That guy hates me. Oh, dead body. I know they're gonna be coming from that side. Here we go. Get up, get up. Ooh! Blood! Don't you jump up in that window. Don't go in there. Yeah, I think I'll pull mine out too. Hopefully I can get one person. What? What? We both failed. You see the gravity spike, dude? We failed at the same time, man. Uh, yeah, there you are. What? Come on, man. Oh, there we go. Colonel Sanders. The Colonel hates me. I know I'm not in the top three. I wasn't really doing, playing the objective or anything like that. But I hope you like this gameplay. If you liked it, you want to see more, crush the like button, show your support, comment down in the comment section below. Let me know what you guys think about uh, Advanced Warfare. Do you believe it's dead? Do you believe it should be laid to rest? Or do you think it's just because not a lot of people are playing it because Black Ops 3 is up? Let me know what you guys think down in the comment section below. Subscribe if you haven't already subscribed, but wait, let's go to the class setup. So we're rocking the KM44 with the Storm Camo. We got that from an Epic Supply Drop, and it is a beauty. It's gorgeous. We use a Rapid Fire, along with Quick Draw, Grip, a Trip Mine, which we don't really need, but we got it anyway, Six Cents. Fast hands and Annie up. So if you like this video and you want to see more of this gameplay, don't forget to crush that like button as hard as you possibly can. Subscribe as well if you haven't already subscribed because it does help the channel grow. I'll see you in the next game. Let's go comment. Oh! Let's go! Storm Kane 44 camo. Epic. It's epic.